Hey guys, what's going on? So this is kind of a idea I came up with to try to raise some money. Um, if you guys remember back toward the end of July in 2022, the vocational school I worked at got flooded really bad and we lost like everything, basically 98% of our equipment. One of the things that I still don't have replaced is a computer capable of editing video. And I had a Mac Mini that I got with a grant years ago that we used iMovie on. And it would actually do a little bit of DaVinci Resolve, but it got flooded. And we still don't have it back yet. So um, I set up something called a Donors Choose, and I actually have two campaigns that have got funded. Um, the first one was for some audio equipment, so my students were able to, to learn how to do some of that and, uh, use a mixer and edit stuff in, um, Audacity, but one of the things I'm supposed to do in the class is video, and we can capture and edit video on the phones, but it's just not ideal. So, um, I'd like to get uh, an iMac to replace that Mac Mini. And I really need an iMac because, I mean, we lost keyboards, mice, all the monitors, everything. So, and the school was insured for the, the contents, not the building, but the contents. But the bureaucracy of, you know, getting them to pay out and all that, it just takes a really long time. And FEMA is supposed to help us too. Um, but you know, uh, right now my kids are sitting there without the ability to, um, to learn how to edit video. And I would really like to get them at least on iMovie or, uh, or DaVinci Resolve. And I know that iMovie is on a lot of iPhones, but not every kid has an iPhone and the experience is just kind of blah, right? What I want to do is is teach the students how to, uh, you know, do some basic um, semi-professional kind of edits, right? And on the phone, um, it's just really not the right kind of experience that I want them to get, right? So I thought I would tell some dumb jokes. Now, I will warn you, these jokes are by and large terrible. Um, so if they're too bad... Yeah, you know, I tried. But if you get a chuckle out of it, I would really appreciate it, and my kids would appreciate it if y'all would click on the link in the description there and donate. At the time I'm recording this, like right now, uh, we need $1,050 to finish funding the iMac, and I have until March 1st. Um, I actually made the campaign um, back in... December or early January, I don't know. Uh, and you have a limited amount of time to get it funded. So um, if we can can get that uh, funded, that would be fantastic. All right. Oh, this slideshow that is uh, ticking by is uh, pictures from, from the vocational school. And you can see all the mud and how high up it got and stuff. Um. And not all this is in my classroom, but whenever you start seeing a bunch of computers and all of that, that's that's where that came from. But anyway, let's let's have a little fun, and uh, I'm going to tell some jokes. All right, so let me switch over here to where I can uh, can see them. And uh, yeah. All right, all right, here we go. Uh, did you hear about the deer that won the lottery? <laughs> it got a million bucks. <laughs> yeah, I know. I, I don't know how I came up with this uh, joke-a-thon concept, but, uh, well, I, I guess I do know. I like stupid jokes, and... Uh, I thought, 
uh, maybe, you know, some people would, uh, would, uh, enjoy that. Uh, a little entertaining. All right, next joke. Let's hide it so y'all can't see it. How can you tell if a tree is a dogwood tree? <laughs> By its bark. <laughs> oh my God. These are being randomly pulled from a list of 269 jokes. I don't know which ones it's going to pull up. So uh, your guess is as good as mine. How do you stop a bull from charging? You cancel its credit card. <laughs> oh, man. I do love dumb jokes. I always have and probably always will. I don't know. Um, I think some people were just a little too serious in this world. So... <laughs> I once had a dream I was floating in the ocean of orange soda. It was more of a fantasy. That one is just... No. <laughs> Why did the golfer bring two pairs of pants? In case he had a hole in one. Oh. <laughs> oh boy. All right, I'm going to go check and see if anybody's actually watching this. Uh it does not appear that that anybody is. This might be a bad time. I don't know, five o'clock on a Saturday. I guess that says more about me than it does anybody else. Um yeah okay so let's try some more some more jokes here what do you call cheese that belongs to somebody else Nacho cheese. I don't know. Why was the man hit by a bike every day? Because he was caught in a vicious cycle. Why can't a nose be 12 inches long? Because then it would be a foot. <laughs> God. Oh. Um. Oh. What's the best way to watch a fly fishing tournament? A live stream. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. How do Eskimos repair broken dishes? With igloo. And believe it or not, I really do think that these are uh, they're pretty amusing. I don't know. Let's see here. What did the ocean say to the beach? Nothing. It just waved. You know, I I should should skip this one, but what do you need to cook an alligator? A crock pot. <laughs> oh, these are just as bad as I thought they would be. I really didn't, you know, uh, check a lot of them out. I just made sure they were, you know, corny dad joke kind of things. <laughs> what, 
What do you call a factory that makes okay products? A satisfactory. <laughs> oh, oh, I, I don't know what in this world possessed me to do this. <laughs> I made a pencil. <laughs> I made a pencil with two erasers. It was pointless. <laughs> huh. Did you hear about the circus fire? It was intense. That one just really doesn't work if you don't read it, I don't think. <clears throat> I used to be afraid of hurdles, but then I got over it. <laughs> God. <laughs> Let's see if anybody's in here watching this. Two, two people. Oh, hmm. Oh, there's my blushing bride. She probably, uh, probably is regretting it right about now. Who else is in here? Uh, well, thank, thanks, whoever it is uh, <laughs> that showed up. Um. Okay, so let me switch back over to the slideshow here. That way, uh, you guys can get a look, you know, at what all happened. Um, all right, let's get back over here to the jokes. <laughs> Why did the tomato blush? It saw a salad dressing. <laughs> Oh my god. That's great. What did one plate say to the other? Lunch is on me. <laughs> that car looks nice, but uh uh, the muffler seems exhausted. <laughs> oh. And no, I, I, you know, most of the people watching this probably know me. Uh, I really do get a chuckle out of these kind of stupid jokes. How does the moon cut its hair? Eclipse it. <laughs> oh man let's see um what do you call an indecisive bug a maybe A cheeseburger walks into a bar. Bartender looks at it and says, Sorry, we don't serve food here. How do trains listen? With engine ears. Oh, that one's not even worth a Laffy Taffy. What did one hat say to the other? You stay here. I'll go ahead. 
<laughs> oh man, that's just Oh no, what happened to my pole? I tried to make a pole. Um, hmm. How do you make the pole show up? <laughs> oh well. <laughs> uh, let's see. Oh, yep. Yeah. Ah, activate pole. There we go. There we go. We've got a pole. Yes, sir. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, let's see. Let's see what the people think. And while the people have a chance to decide... You think swimming with sharks is expensive? Swimming with sharks cost me an arm and a leg. <laughs> uh, okay. Did you hear about the coffee robbery? It got mugged. Did you hear about the guy who invented the knock-knock joke? He won the Nobel Prize. <laughs> oh, my God. <sighs> what did the envelope say to the stamp? <laughs> Stick with me and you'll go places. <laughs> oh, gosh. Okay. Why do bees have sticky hair? Because they use a honeycomb. <laughs> oh. Hmm, let's see. What do clouds wear? Thunderwear. Horrible. Why did the cookie go to the doctor? It felt crummy. <laughs> did you hear about the Italian cook who had an accident? He passed away. No. What kind of teeth do deer have? Buck teeth.
What did the zero say to the eight? That belt looks good on you. <laughs> oh my god. What do sea monsters eat for dinner? Fish and ships. How do mice floss their teeth? With string cheese. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Let's see what else we got here. <clears throat> Why don't animals play poker in the jungle? Too many cheetahs. <laughs> All right, Beck, I think you'll like this one. How do you know when a pepper is mad? It gets jalapeno. It gets jalapeno your face. Jalapeno your face. There we go. I don't know. I couldn't even. I died. Yeah. It was a lot better joke than I, than I delivered. How do you make a Kleenex dance? Put a little boogie in it. <laughs> Where do you learn to make a banana split? Sunday school. This one's horrible. A guy walks into a bar and he was disqualified from the limbo contest. Mm. <laughs> Why does Snoop Dogg use an umbrella? For drizzle. Where do math teachers go on vacation? Times Square. Oh dear. <clears throat> Did you read the book about anti-gravity? You can't put it down. Oh, let's see here. You know, people say they pick their nose, but I feel like I was born with mine. Why shouldn't you marry a calendar? Its days are numbered. <laughs> what did the coffee report to the police? A mugging. I got to get this one out. This is legitimately good. What is the difference between a poorly dressed man on a tricycle 
and a well-dressed man on a bicycle. Attire. <laughs> oh. Why don't eggs tell jokes? Because they'd crack each other up. I'm so good at sleeping. I can do it with my eyes closed. Why did the nurse keep a red pen handy in case she had to draw blood? What do you get from a pampered cow? <laughs> Spoiled milk. <laughs> A skeleton walks into a bar and says, Hey, bartender, I'll have one beer and a mop. <laughs> it takes guts to be an organ donor. Why are ghosts bad liars? Because you can see right through them. What kind of shoes do bananas wear? Slippers. <laughs> What's a cucumber's favorite sport? Pickleball. I've heard of pickleball. I don't know what it is. Um, let's see. Activate the poll so viewers can vote. It is active. It says. It should have been a pop-up, I think. Over the... Let's see here. Um... I don't know. Ah, somebody found it. Somebody found it. They they say they like the jokes. I don't know. Um, let's see. <laughs> what did baby corn say to mama corn? Where's popcorn? Oh my god. Um, yeah, in, in case uh, you don't really know why I'm doing this, if you got in here a little bit late, <clears throat> I'm telling these horrible jokes to try to uh, raise money to get a replacement video editing computer uh, for my students. And I've got a Donors Choose campaign where you can donate if you, if you want to. Uh, we lost... 98% of everything we had at the school I teach at uh, in in uh, the end of July 2022 and the red tape and everything trying to get stuff replaced means that there's a lot of things that I just really don't have that the students uh, are missing out on uh, this particular school year. One of them is a, a video editing computer and I had an iMac we used to use or a uh, a Mac Mini that we used to use, but it has uh, uh, it got flooded. So, and uh, you can see the slideshow flashing with um, the damage to the school. 
Uh, now we will get back to the jokes. How did the duck buy lipstick? She just put it on her bill. I was going to tell a time traveling joke, but you guys didn't like it. <laughs> oh my God. Uh, Dad, can you put my shoes on? No, I don't think they'll fit me. <laughs> This one's great. <clears throat> what do you call an automobile filled with water? A carpool. <laughs> oh. I used to hate facial hair, but then it grew on me. Did you hear the rumor about butter? Well, I'm not going to spread it. <laughs> this one's even better given what happened last year. Um, how do you follow Will Smith in the snow? You follow the Fresh Prince. <laughs> what do you call a guy who's always writing out checks? Bill. If a child refuses to nap, are they guilty of resisting a rest? <laughs> oh. Oh no. Whenever I try to eat healthy, a chocolate bar looks at me and snickers. Oh, that's just awful. <laughs> How do you get a good price on a sled? You have to bargain. What did the ocean say to the sad seaweed? Sea kelp. <laughs> Want to hear a joke about paper? Never mind. It's terrible. <laughs> God. What do you call a rude cow? Beef jerky. <laughs> oh, man. Let's see here. Oh, no. <clears throat> Why did the girl jump up and down before pouring her juice? The carton said, shake well before drinking. <laughs> oh, no. What's the best smelling insect? Deodorant. <laughs> oh, that's great. <clears throat> Ha, ha, ha. 
Singing in the shower is fun until you get soap in your mouth. Then it's a soap opera. <laughs> I think that joke would have been better if it was until you get suds in your mouth. Then it's a soap opera. I don't know. Maybe somebody that decides to do a joke a again will take that into advisement. Who am I kidding? Nobody has ever done this. Nobody. <laughs> um, but that's okay. Um, why shouldn't you trust stairs? They're always up to something. Did you hear about the man who's paranoid about picnics? He's a basket case. <laughs> oh, God. oh. What kind of award would you give the dentist of the year? A little plaque. <laughs> 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 oh man I remember this joke from whenever I was a kid why do cows wear bells their horns don't work When does a joke become a dad joke? When it becomes apparent. <sighs> oh. <laughs> it's inappropriate to make a dad joke if you're not a dad. It's faux pas. When two vegans get into an argument, is it still called a beef? <sighs> okay. Why did the bank robber wash his clothes before escaping? He wanted a clean getaway. <laughs> How do you fix a cracked pumpkin with a pumpkin patch? Do you want a box for your leftovers? No, but I'll wrestle you for them. <laughs> oh, this this is this is painful. This is so painful. Did you hear the about the girl who cut off the left side of her body? She's all right. All right, guys, five more jokes. Five more jokes. I'm going to wrap this up. Five more jokes, okay? So, um, <laughs> and, and please realize that if I'm willing to do this 100%, make a total fool of myself, well, that's just a random Saturday for me, so it's <laughs> No, but seriously, if you can spare uh, a dime, 
Well, actually, it's, I think, $5 minimum. But if you could spare 5 bucks, uh, and uh, and donate and help us to reach that goal so the, the kids can have something to edit video on, that'd be fantastic. And uh, thank you to all the people that had donated before I did this live stream. And I've donated myself, too. Um, so I'm not just asking y'all to do it. But let, let's hope the random joke uh, selector here gives us five good ones for the end here. What do you call people who sleep in their socks? Tiny. If you see a crime happen at the Apple store, what does that make you? An eyewitness. <laughs> That's awesome. That's fantastic. That actually was good. <clears throat> How, do <laughs> How does a taco say grace? Let us pray. Oh man. Um What country's capital is growing the fastest? Ireland. Every day it's Dublin. What do we got? Two more jokes? Let's go two more. Why is six scared? Because seven, eight, nine. All right, last joke. Last joke. Please let it be a good one for our finale. <laughs> What's the best thing about Switzerland? I don't know, but its flag is a big plus. I gotta say, I gotta say, I'm pretty tickled with, with that, that last one there. That, uh, yeah, that was good. <laughs> that was good. So, um, we're coming up on 43 minutes of this foolishness, and I'm gonna wrap it up there. Um, I, I'll say again, if you can spare, uh, you know, five bucks, uh, I would greatly appreciate it and my students would greatly appreciate it. And, uh, it would be one more thing that we can kind of get back to normal with. And that is doing a little video editing, but, uh, uh, thank you all so much, uh, for anybody that made it this far, you're a brave, brave soul. Um, but God bless y'all and have a fantastic day.